The Pearl was designed to bring more than just housing downtown, but also entertainment. After two and a half years of construction, the Pearl has officially opened. Seeing it on paper is one thing, but when you see it come to life, it's just incredible. Chuck Surak, the CEO of Surak Enterprises, who partnered with the city of Fort Wayne to make the Pearl possible, hopes this is another way for him and his wife to give back to the city. We love Fort Wayne. Fort Wayne's been incredibly good to us, and we know we can't take it with us. We haven't seen U-Hauls at uh, cemeteries very often, and just my wife and I are just happy to be able to give back. Mayor Sharon Tucker believes the Pearl will give back in more ways than one. Our skyline downtown is definitely changing, and it's changing for the good so that we can welcome people to our community, which ultimately helps build our economy. Besides the 76 apartments, the seven-story building also has amenities for the public to enjoy, including Crescendo Coffee and various green spaces with fire pits, grilling areas, and even miniature golf. And even if you're not great at miniature golf like me, Surak hopes that these green spaces outside of the apartments will be a great way for the community of Fort Wayne to come together. I love the whole building. It's just done so well, but the seventh floor is particularly special. We have a green space up there and you can look right down Main Street and it's just a beautiful view. Um, there's, there's pool table and ping pong table and there's a green space with a grill and all kinds of stuff. Both Surak and Mayor Tucker hope the Pearl will give back for years to come. You know, we have a new place to brag about. We have the Pearl, right? We have a new place for Fort Wayne Visiting Center to go out and share with the community. Pearl is still taking applications for those interested in living in the new apartment complex. Or if you just want to enjoy its beauty, Crescendo Coffee on the first level is now open. Reporting in studio, Allie Butts, 21 Alive News.